So we are in Vande Bharat Express, which is from Borivali to Varodra. We did not get a ticket to Ekta Nagar Station, so we had to catch this. And Vande Bharat itself was a different experience. We had to experience this. See the train; it's lovely. And going with family is a different experience altogether in Vande Bharat. So finally, we have reached Varodra Station, and on the way, and we have reached Unity Village Resort, getting fresh and getting. ready to finally go and visit the statue of unity the resort was very good it had good amenities it had a swimming pool and finally uh, we are reached the first point which is the sardar sarovar dam and um, on the way it is a lot of walking 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 and uh, from there we got a bus and um, we have uh, planning to go to the main attraction which is the statue of unity so a uh, statue of unity is a lot of walking uh, to reach there is a uh, little difficult for elderly we had an express entry this is the narmada river uh, which we see through the statue of unity so um, it was a in all a good experience it is the world's largest statue Uh, this is the inside of देखो, as देखो, we देखो, enter the statue of Unity building. देखो. This is what we see. It is the history of uh, Sardar Vallabh Bhai Patel ji and the making of the statue. Finally, a lot of photographs uh, with the statue and the Narmada River and different poses. So this was the main attraction. Uh, it took us around around about. Two hours uh, at this place uh, to explore the place uh, correctly, and uh, see this is where I'm standing at the foot, and the statue seems to be so high up above, touching the sky. So um, these are uh, various clicks is was a must at the Statue of Unity. so we had uh, visited uh, we had taken the express ticket which included the laser show as well uh, this laser show is about 25 minutes laser show uh, wherein they tell us the story of sardar vallabh bhai patel following the laser show we had to go to unity glow garden this is the only evening attraction over there which is uh, good for the kids also there was a dj uh, music and uh, with a dance floor which had lights on it and the garden was completely glowed so hence the name called as the unity glow garden uh, it was had had good music and uh, good uh, photographs to be clicked at this place uh, good for children like see how mew is just running around here and there so finally the unity glow garden and uh, following the unity glow garden we had to uh, go for a laser show oh, sorry uh, fi- following the unity glow garden uh, we were up for a night tour so uh, this is the night tour uh, which uh, we travel by our car only in which the whole uh, the lanes and everything is been lighted and finally dinner at the resort so this is the beginning of day 2 morning was a leisure we play see this is the view at the unity village resort and i and mehan were just clicking pictures and enjoying the pleasant weather uh so unity village resort was a breakfast point and after which we went to the pet zoo uh which was our first point of the day uh there we saw various pet animals so we saw various pet animals this is the goat and then a small cow hen and goats were like all around the pigeon and the pony and the goat again the mouse uh, this is some goose small small pets all around in the pet zone enjoying the guinea pigs the ducks and these are the rabbits of all colors various types of birds raccoon uh, persian cat and this is the raccoon wandering here and there and again the rabbits and uh, rabbit burrows were made and certain selfies with my friends and then uh, the coming to the next point which is the jungle safari yeah. 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 
at the okay, beginning okay. of the entrance okay, okay. there were this was a something like a 3d animation with all the animals we were just uh, attracted to this and uh, there were various animals coming and going uh, finally this is a tegu iguana and the turtle moving around this is like a bird park where we saw many birds it was the main attraction uh, birds like um, ostrich and these are the cranes and yeah the main attraction was the peacock dancing and uh, never seen like this uh, before the peacock was wonderful and then these are the other small birds like cranes eating fishes and peacocks and other birds walking around at the bird park and then uh, finally uh, of course watching all the animals at the zoo uh, there were a lot of walking but at some point then we took a bogey or a golf cart uh, wherein uh, we were sitting in the cart and taking the pictures of all the animals this is the bear there was a deer there was a tegu iguana uh, tiger lion monkeys jumping all around this is the python and uh, these are the ostriches and finally the last attraction was the giraffe and we had it towards the bus stop for uh, the final attraction of the day which was the nutrition park uh, so this is what we did until we waited for the bus to come and we had a lunch uh, very close to the nutrition park there was a food mall it is called as ekta food mall so we had lunch over there followed by a uh, visit to the children nutrition park yes uh, the children nutrition park is a must to go uh, if you have come along with your children this is the point three there is as you enter there is a toy train uh, which takes you to eight destinations these eight destinations teach you different things about uh, nutrition and they teach you about how to save water and then again uh, they carry you from one stop to another through the toy trains and at each stop there are different games for the children sometimes uh, some such some places there are games for the adults as well this was a 5d movie which we saw which took us to different parts of the country and the foods of the different parts of the states of india uh, so certain games which tells us about the unity in diversity so in uh, with different games and different video shows these are the games for the children and these are the games for small children and then games for us so uh, in all a very good uh, knowledgeable uh, point for the kids and uh, as well as for the adults so finally we went to the ekta mall uh, we shopped over there um, at the ekta mall again it was a very beautiful mall which is which is unique features in which there were all different uh, uh, states there were shops of different states selling the famous things of those particular state and post the mall we went to the resort we played lots of games uh, carrom badminton and uh, we enjoyed and uh, post that we had a uh, dinner at the resort itself and so that was the, the next day as well so this was the end of our day 2 good night Welcome to day 3. Super super up in the swimming pool. We have gone to the photo and we are ready to go to the one. Yes, this is our first point uh, of day 3. Arogya one means the name itself says that it has uh, it is a garden which has all the medicines, medicinal plants. Uh, they have made an Aushadi Manav in which they have shown the head, uh, the hands and the legs. So we start from one hand, we travel through the legs and we end at another end. So these are some certain medicinal plants or ye sab ghar mein kaun se hum plants uga sakte hai aur yahan se chalu hote hai mere real show kyunki bohut barish ho rahi thi humko bhugi lena pada tha aur koi bhigna nahi chata tha mere ilawa so maine hi bohut sare bhagne ke daudne ke ghumne ke jhumne ke barish mein reels banaye hai thodi der ke liye mihan jumping kar raha tha baki to ye dekhiye mere hi reels hai mere hi poses hai ये आरोग्य बन में ये वाली बुगी से हम लोग ज्यादा ट्रैवल कर रहे थे क्योंकि बारिश हो रही थी सो इन ऑल बहुत सारे फोटोज थे ये है मानव जो कि एकता के साथ यूनिटी के साथ नेचर के साथ यूनिटी में 
रहते हैं एक सेल्फी पॉइंट है यहाँ पे जहाँ पे जिस जहाँ पे हमने बहुत सारे फोटोज़ खींचे हैं सेल्फी पॉइंट पे जहाँ से पूरा ये वाला पॉइंट था जहाँ से पूरा आरोग्य वन अच्छे से दिख रहा है एंड देन वी स्टार्ट फॉर मियावा की फॉरेस्ट लेकिन बहुत बारिश हो रही थी तो मियावा की फॉरेस्ट भी एक वीडियो दिखाया और बच्चे लोग वहाँ पे खेल रहे थे बाकी मैं और देवेश फिर ये देखो ये गार्डन देखने अंदर तक गए यहाँ पे बहुत अच्छा बुद्धा का ये स्टैचू लगाया हुआ था मियावा की फॉरेस्ट के अंदर और मियावा की फॉरेस्ट से हम लोग निकल पड़े कोलचा के लिए जहाँ पर सबसे बड़ा स्वामी नारायण का टेम्पल है रियोली में इतना यूज इतना वास टेम्पल है देख के बहुत अच्छा लगा बच्चों के लिए भी बहुत अच्छा है ओपन है और बहुत सारे फोटोज़ भी यहाँ पे अच्छे आए हैं कृष्ण भगवान की पूरी लीला यहाँ पे बताई गई है स्टैचूज़ के फॉर्म में तो ओवरऑल यहाँ टेम्पल पे ही हमने थोड़ा सा घूम के थोड़ी सी पूजा करके और लंच कर लिया है दैट्स इट द एंड ऑफ डे थ्री यहाँ से हम निकल पड़े अपनी गाड़ी में वडोदरा स्टेशन के लिए बैक टू मुंबई वी हैड टू कैच अ गोल्डन टेंपल गोल्डन टेंपल ट्रेन सिक्स इलेवन की गोल्डन टेंपल ट्रेन थी और दैट्स इट बाई इलेवन ओ क्लॉक वी वर एट मुंबई